The UN revised standard minimum rules for the treatment of prisoners, the Nelson Mandela rules, convey a simple but profound message, namely that prisoners are human beings born in dignity and entitled to security and to protection of their human rights. The Mandela rules contain crucial revisions of the 60-year-old international standards. Uh, they confirm that all prisoners are to be treated with respect and that no prisoners shall be subjected to and all prisoners shall be protected from torture and other cruel, inhuman and degrading treatment or punishment. It is my sincere hope that the Mandela rules will continue to be a work in progress, evolving over time to afford even greater protection to detainees. We must not await another 60 years before setting the bar higher. That is what Mandela would expect from us. Yes, today, 60 years after the US we have important work ahead, and the United States is no exception. While we are home to just 5% of the world's population, we have 25% of the world's prisoners. This summer, President Obama became the first ever sitting president to visit a federal prison, where he spoke about the urgent need for prison reform in the United States. He declared unequivocally that, quote, we should not tolerate conditions in prison that have no place in any civilized country.